I bet you've wondered why periods happen every month. Well, you're not alone. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of the menstrual cycle. It's like a biological clock ticking away inside half the world's population. So let's unravel this monthly mystery together. The menstrual cycle is like a hormonal roller coaster orchestrated by the pituitary gland and hypothalamus in your brain. During the first half of the cycle, called the follicular phase, FSH kicks things off. It's like a wake-up call for the egg follicles in your ovaries. As these follicles mature, they start pumping out estrogen. This estrogen is busy too. It's thickening the lining of your uterus. Now, here comes the main event, ovulation. Around day 14 of your cycle, there's a sudden surge of LH. This triggers the release of a mature egg from one of your ovaries. At the same time, you might notice a temporary boost in libido. So, what happens after the egg is released? Well, the follicle that released the egg transforms into something called the corpus luteum. This little structure starts pumping out progesterone, which keeps the uterine lining thick and cozy, just in case a fertilized egg decides to make itself at home. But if fertilization doesn't happen, the corpus luteum breaks down after about 14 days. When it does, progesterone levels drop, and that's when things start to fall apart. Literally, the thickened uterine lining no longer supported by progesterone begins to shed. And voila, that's your period. So that's the incredible journey of the menstrual cycle. From follicles to ovulation, from hopeful waiting to the grand finale of menstruation. When you think about the intricate biology behind it all, it's pretty amazing. Your body is performing a monthly miracle. Now let's talk about how long menstruation actually lasts. For most people, a period typically lasts between three and seven days. This is the time when the uterine lining is shed and leaves the body as menstrual flow. But not everyone is the same. Some people have shorter periods, lasting just a couple of days, while others might experience bleeding for up to a week or even a little longer. So, what affects how long your period lasts? Several factors come into play. Age is one. Teens and people approaching menopause often have more irregular or longer periods. Hormones are another big factor. If your hormone levels fluctuate, your period might be longer or shorter than usual. Stress, changes in weight, intense exercise, and certain health conditions like polycystic ovary syndrome, PCOS, or thyroid disorders can also impact the duration and flow of your period. If you ever notice a sudden change in your period length, or if your periods are extremely long, heavy, or painful, it's a good idea to talk to a healthcare provider. They can help you figure out what's normal for you and address any concerns. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you never miss out on more educational videos. Stay tuned for more fascinating science.